Hello, Patrick Walchuk here, and I want to welcome you to this fabulous new listing. We're at 23 Foothills Drive in the Linwood Village area, Bells Corners. Now, what we're looking at here is a bungalow that's got two units in it, and the second unit's in the basement. It's called an SDU, or a secondary dwelling unit, and we will have an occupancy permit uh, for you uh, on this property. Now, each unit has three bedrooms, one and a half bathrooms. It's got its own laundry, very key to getting a quality tenant. Six appliances. Each unit has its own hot water tank and each unit has 100 amp uh, hydro panel and we'll show you a couple of uh, new um, hydro uh, panels outside as well. Now it was all completed just in May of 2022. The upper area or the bungalow itself that's been extensively renovated and the lower level it's just all newly constructed. It was taken right down to the uh, concrete walls. And the driveway that you've uh, been able to see here, that was paved just a few days ago. And you can park six cars here and uh, two cars in the garage side by side. That is extremely, extremely rare for a tenant to property where each tenant would have uh, an inside uh, or garage parking. Now, just before we show you the property itself, let me tell you about the financials. So the main floor here, real Realistically, would rent for about $2,200, the lower level for $2,000, and the tenants uh, would pay their own heat, hydro, water, sewer. The owner pays taxes and insurance. So the gross income, based on the rents I just told you about, would be $50,400, and the expenses are $6,750, and that gives you an annual cash flow of $43,650. And based on those calculations alone, we're looking at a cap or a capitalization rate here of 5.1%. So come on with me, and we'll start off by showing you the uh, main floor or the bungalow unit. So here we are inside the main floor of the bungalow, and we'll give you a little tour. Um, huge, massive windows. This is a really bright, bright room. Uh, hardwood floors, working wood-burning fireplace. And as we come around here, this was open, but there had been a wall here separating the kitchen from the dining room. So they took down the wall and created this beautiful open concept and remember I told you there's two hydrometers outside, so each unit has its own hydro panel, okay, and it's 100 amps uh, each. So moving on into the kitchen, again, open concept, and this would be a, a lovely home for, for a family, and then you use the downstairs to help pay your mortgage, or both units as an investment property. And you can see here the... Uh, Soft closed doors, isn't that wonderful? Uh, the entire kitchen is, is brand new. And by the way, the window in the dining room, the window in the uh, kitchen, they're both brand new as well. And everything, you know, the pot lights. And down this way, we'll take you uh, to the bedrooms. And this part of the house, we'll start by showing you uh, the bedrooms. Cameraman's going to, uh, to slowly pan around. And uh, these are really exceptionally sized bedrooms. And you'll, you'll see that there's two closets in this bedroom, which is um, very unique for a house of this vintage. And again, you would have seen the uh, extra large windows. And directly across the hall, you'll see the newly renovated bathroom, a four-piece bath. And all the plumbing in here has been replaced as well. Coming back out, I want to draw your attention to the in-suite laundry. And again, this is so, so important to having a good quality tenant. And in here, the second of three bedrooms. And notice all the closet space that, that we have here as well. Following along, we'll end up in the primary bedroom. And the cameraman can show you all of the closet space down at the end. 
And as he slowly pans around, you've got a couple of large windows here. Again, these rooms are so nice and bright. And in here is the two-piece ensuite bathroom. Okay, and the cameraman's now showing you a little bit of the <clears throat> side of the house. We're off to the left of it where the garage is located. <clears throat> and as we walk along here, um, again, one of the things I wanted to emphasize is that the people who uh, uh, recently did the renovations, uh, we, we had a couple of hydro meters installed here, so each tenant pays for their own hydro. And this is also the access to the basement secondary dwelling unit. So there's a back door for the garage, and here you can see this interlocking patio, storage shed, great side yard, fully fenced, and this is the door to the basement. So come on, let's go take a look at it. Here we are in the basement of the secondary dwelling unit. Again, it's a three bedroom apartment, and we've got some storage space here, little seating area when you come in, Nice closet here, very convenient for coats and boots and things. And as we walk around here, uh, this is the kitchen area, stainless steel appliances. And I'll tell you a little bit more before we get into things. So when this was created, the, uh, the people that own it put in electric baseboards and sound proofing insulation, all the joist cavities that run along here, and spray foam insulation in the walls. And again, that's because they took this right down to the concrete so they could do that kind of thing. Uh, all the windows down here are new, except for two of them. There's resilient channel ceiling uh, uh, in, in here. And what that does, it dampens the sound sounds, it dissipates the energy so it inhibits uh, sound transmission between the two units. And uh, the cameraman will show you the flooring. They put in uh, a luxury vinyl plank flooring which looks really good and it's uh, a very, very durable type of flooring. And just like upstairs, the cabinetry, soft clothes, gotta love it. And over here, as I mentioned, just like the upstairs unit, we have, um, you know, we don't necessarily need to see this in great detail, but there's a hydro panel in here. Over here, and notice the huge windows, so, uh, you know, designed that way for fire code purposes. Um, really, really good use of space here, storage space. Underneath the stairs, more storage space. And we'll show you a couple of rooms here before the bedrooms. This is the laundry room to start with. And as the cameraman goes around the corner, you're going to see two rented hot water tanks and the furnace. Okay, and in the room next door where we showed you the laundry area is the uh, brand new four-piece bathroom. So come on with me and we'll show you where the bedrooms are. And now the cameraman's going to show you bedroom number one. And along here, right beside it, bedroom number two. Again, with the vinyl plank flooring. And finally, the primary bedroom. And just like we had upstairs, there's a, a very convenient two-piece ensuite off of the uh, primary.
So there you have it. Again, 23 foothills in Linwood Village in Bells Corners. If you have any questions, give me a call if you'd like a private viewing. Patrick Walchuk, 613-290-9297. Thank you.